What is up my dude and dudettes and welcome back to TellerTube. In today's video we're going to be looking at the subreddit r slash choosing beggars. If you're new to my channel be sure to subscribe so you can stay up to date with my latest videos. With that being said sit back relax and enjoy the video. I saw your free dishwasher you have on Craigslist. I live in Smyrna though, got anything else to throw in to make it worth my time? I'll tell you what, I'll knock half off the asking price, how's that? <laughs> I'm already giving it away for free, Karen. What more do you want? If I do a job in 30 minutes, it's because I spent 10 years learning how to do that in 30 minutes. You owe me for the years, not the minutes. You still owe me full price. $50, $60, what? For the PlayStation, just the PlayStation? No everything, I'm haggling, yo. Hello, my ad said the PlayStation 4 has two controllers, a PSVR setup, and three games for $300. I said in the ad, no haggling. I won't respond anymore after this text. $300? Everyone haggles. $100 is the most I'm gonna offer. Yo, you about to miss out on some serious cash. This would be a good Christmas gift for my brother, man. $100, take it or leave it. I'm reporting your ad, it's getting taken down because you can't reach a deal. Or maybe offer a reasonable price, chief. $2 is not a tip. $5 is not a tip. Anything I give you outside this mother frickin' bill is the tip. Two bucks? That's it? <laughs> Searching for a photographer for my wedding, here are my requirements. Must be willing to job for free. Must have at least eight years of experience. Must be at the wedding all the time, no breaks. Bring your own food and drinks. <laughs> wow, I wonder how many people came running for this job. <laughs> Zero. Blank sent you a request for $20. I bought you drinks and we didn't hook up. You owe me 20. Hey, I heard from Blank that you baked a cake for your team on his birthday. It's my birthday next week, can you bake me a cake and bring it to the office? It's free, right? Hi, Blank. Yes, I baked it for him because in our team we usually pull money to buy a cake or someone volunteers to make it for them instead. Are you sure you want me to bake it? I've never spoken to anyone on your side of the office, and I don't know if it would make any sense if I came to give it to you and your team. <laughs> I was gonna buy a cake too, but it's free to ask you to make it, so can you do this cake? On Monday, bring it to my desk at 2 and I'll just give it to everyone, so it's not awkward for you to talk to my people. It's Ferrero Rocher and Lint Truffles and stuff, but you can just count the cost as my birthday gift, lol. I can make you box cake or cookies. What the frick? You're joking, right, lol? No, I'm really sorry, but the fact that you just want me to make this cake and deliver it to your desk so you can present it as your own contribution makes no sense to me. Also, I'm going to be kind of busy this weekend dog sitting. I think maybe it's best for you to order a cake so you know it'll be up to your standards or something. You think I have money for that? Please! You're my coworker. It's my birthday. I want this cake. Sorry, I really can't help. See you tomorrow. I'm going to avoid you in the office from now on and tell everyone who you really are. Watch your back. HR might want a word with you soon. Yeah, you won't make me a cake for my birthday? Don't be surprised if you're fired. As a last minute resort, me and my sister went to the subway to get 63 foot long subs for my grandson's confirmation party and had to wait over an hour for the subs. Ridiculously long wait and the lady who took my order seemed really annoyed with me. Everyone who works in customer service should legally be allowed to fight one customer a year. You had to wait over an hour? Yeah, maybe because you ordered 63 sandwiches. <laughs> Jeez. My coworker had a baby girl last week. And to celebrate, he took us all out to lunch. My other coworker ordered an extra steak and two slices of cheesecake to take out. When some of us asked her why, she said it was because it was free. She even knew Blank was paying. Oh my goodness, is she serious? Now that's just ridiculous. Come on, Karen. 2300. Don't have 2300. Any lower? Okay, if you pay today, 2000. I've got a thousand and a baby crocodile. <laughs> what? Okay, why do you have a baby crocodile though? One star. They told me the rent was 900, but I offered $800. They persisted on telling me that was 900. Unbelievable. So I went to the Dunkin' Donuts here on Davis. So my purchase was a couple dollars and two cents. I see they have a tip jar with some pennies in there. I was told I cannot take from there. Seriously? It's two freaking pennies. Um, <laughs> you can't be serious. 
That's literally stealing. <laughs> Donkey. I'll pay whatever your rate is because I love your art and understand how hard you work. <laughs> if only it were always like this. Hey mate, I got your quote and it's not making sense to me. You quoted 2400 but I figured it should be around 980 to 1000 tops. Get back to me please. Um, yeah you're wrong chief. 2400 or I'm not doing it. Can you sell it for 100 cash? No, sorry. How about 80? Um, that's less money. So? So no. <laughs> One star. Called to see if they had a military discount, and yes, they do 5%. They can't even give 10%. Glad my service means nothing to these people. They're already giving me 5%, but I deserve more. Trampoline. Free. Come get it. Works great. No cuts or tears. SNK will pick it up. <laughs> Where is this made? Who has been on it? Very particular on what my kids touch. It's free, you turd. <laughs> Just take the damn thing. I would dump a guy if he got me a nasty cheap Pandora ring for my engagement. A guy should spend at least 20% of his yearly salary on a ring, don't you agree girls? Hashtag weddings, hashtag travel. Holy smokes, this girl's in for a rude awakening. Can someone please help me find a car? $900 or less, with low mileage, I'm not too picky. 2004 Chevrolet Cavalier. it's decent, but it's ugly. Chief. You literally said you're not too picky. <laughs> hey there, I heard you publish and produce board games. Yes we do, what were you looking for? I have an idea for a board game I think would be a huge hit. Can I send you some hand-drawn images? We're probably not a fit, we mostly do our own designs in-house. But I know some excellent designers who can help you. Why can't I just send them to you and you make them? It's just not our business model. We design, manufacture, and sell our own IP. I can recommend plenty of designers and even a factory to help you get your project done. Will they charge me? Most designers are professionals who have to make a living too. What if I give them a percent of my profit? This is going to be really big. Honestly, I'm really busy, let me know if you want those contacts. Why can't you just help me? I'm trying to give you some guidance, but I can't do what you're asking for. Good luck. I've been working on this for five years. Well, if you only have some handwritten notes after five years, you need more than a little help. What the frick does that mean? I'm a single mother living with my parents. I just don't have the time or money that you do. OMG, why did you wait so long to tell me that? Of course I'll help. Send your stuff to my fo at mybreedingchoicesrequireyourservices.com. You're a piece of crap butthole. I hope you need something from somebody one day. Honestly, that's not even the first time I've heard this today. Savage. Custom scooter, $400. Cool. Is $25 okay? It was $800 brand new. Bro, all it is is metal and plastic and rubber put together. $25 is more than enough. Seriously, dude? $25 is more than enough. You're a pedo scamming children. What? <laughs> I'm not giving you the scooter for like 95% off, bucko. Hi, is the CRV still available? Sorry, it's sold. For how much? 700. I would pay 500 for it. May I have it? <laughs> I'm serious, I need a car. So you want me to get a sold car back and give it to you for less than I sold it for? Yes, I need a car. <laughs> like this person actually can't be serious. That literally makes no sense whatsoever. Ugh, oh, some people, man. Part-time job, 65k. Looking for a part-time job here in Ruxford that pays 65,000 a year. Need flexible schedule, minimal hours, and benefits. No call centers or summer sales. Thanks. <laughs> a part-time job that's gonna give you 65k? And you need to work minimal hours? Best of luck with that, bucko. <laughs> oh my god. Yesterday, a homeless person asked for money when I was drunk. I was feeling nice, so I pulled out my wallet and pulled out $26, only meant to pull out 6. I separate the $6 from the 26, give him 6, and put the 20 back. And this mother fricker says, Nah man, the frick? Give me that 20, not that bullcrap. <laughs> well, alright chief, now you get nothing. CEO gives his employees $2,000 to go on vacation and says they're more productive than ever. First, you have to care about your employees. $2,000 vacation? Only Thailand might fit in that budget. Really? You're complaining about a free 2k to put towards a vacation. Way to miss the whole point. LOL. Missing it completely and happily. Oh my goodness. I need a babysitter every day 9am to 7pm. 
weekly pay, 175 a week, two 11 year olds, one five year old, and one one year old. So $25 a day for 10 hour days. <laughs> Classic. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, smash that like button as it would really help me out. Subscribe to my channel so you can stay up to date with my latest videos. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.